Monday over the restructuring of rosters. It is now seven minutes past seven. You are taking the main news bulletin on Morning Live on SABC2. Good morning. A veritable treasure trove of Zulu culture will soon be crossing over to London's High Street. It may be an unexpected tourism spin-off for South Africa ahead of the World Cup of 2010. Sweeping scenes of Africa in the heart of London. A 66 million rand Zulu theme venue named after the revered King Shaka Zulu will open its doors in the cosmopolitan city in April. It's uh, 27,000 square feet over two floors and it's 840 covers. So it's going to be one of the largest restaurants of its kind and it's certainly going to be the largest restaurant development in 2010 in the UK. An African theatre, nightclub and restaurants offering mainly Zulu cuisine will be promoted directly into influential society circles. With fame battles binding the two nations, interest in this project seemed apparent. Well, in fact, I've met the South African Tourist Board in London recently, and they're very keen that this could be a showcase for inbound traffic from the UK to South Africa. And in fact, in May, we're planning to hold a fundraising event for Education Africa, where we're hoping that Premiership footballers from Britain will attend, and we can raise a substantial figure to help the uh, programme in the townships. Pain has also sought counsel from the current Zulu king, Gudul Zulatini, to ensure authenticity. It's a tasty tantalizer for international tourists wanting to experience the real deal. Blaine Herman, SABC News, Durban. Let's take a look at your